So let's talk about how to grow your portfolio or your dividend portfolio over time. The easiest way out there, if you're involved in a 401k or a mutual fund, it's doing the same thing as what I'm about to explain to you and you can do it also, okay? It's called a drip account. And what a drip account stands for is a dividend reinvestment plan, okay? Very simple. Hey, I'm Doug with Money Sage, and let's talk about drip accounts today and how they can help you grow your portfolio, okay? So let's start over with, um, you know, a drip account is, you know, it, it is a reinvestment plan. So when you get paid dividends, those dividends are going to be reinvested in additional shares of the stock that you've got or ETF or mutual fund, whichever symbol you've got. Um, and it's going to buy additional shares, either whole shares or fractional shares. Okay. So let's say that you own a stock and it's a quarterly dividend, you know, got just got paid out yesterday and it was $2, but the stock is trading at $20 a share. Well, therefore you can't buy an additional share or it won't do it automatically. What it'll do is it'll automatically buy additional uh, fractional shares, okay? And those fractional shares build up to whole shares and stuff like this, but you still get paid dividends on the fractional shares, okay? And that normally happens on the payout date. So uh, I've got two different plans, you know, that I use and or two different brokers for those. And one broker, they reinvest it immediately on the same day it pays out. The other one does it the day after, after bookkeeping runs, okay? But it is a great way to have an automatic growth to your portfolio. Now, one of the things I like is, um, and I'll just use TD Ameritrade for example, TD Ameritrade is a broker that will allow you to pick and choose which stocks in your portfolio are on drip. So you can have other stocks that you're trading, you're doing swing trades with, or, um, or maybe day trading or something else like that. But you could also have a regular cash account or an IRA account that is your long-term dividend portfolio. And you can choose the stocks that you want to put on drip. Now, normally when you do this, uh, it normally takes maybe a day or two for the drips to really start taking effect um, in their system. But after that, once the dividend pays out, the next payout, you're going to see TD Ameritrade or your broker, whoever it be, is going to automatically reinvest those dividends into more shares of that symbol. So therefore, you can watch your portfolio grow over time. So if you've watched my videos on dollar cost averaging, that's what drip accounts use. So you're automatically taking the effect or taking the benefits of dollar cost averaging when you set a stock or your entire portfolio to be on a drip type plan. Okay. Please hope that helps you out and uh, have a great day. Anyways, if you hit the like button below, if you like the video, definitely hit the subscribe button and the bell beside it. That way you get a notice every time I release a new video. But hey, thank you for watching and good luck with your trades. Thank you.